a bad mindset will hold you back from achieving the things that you want to achieve. And before you click off this video because I'm talking about mindset, you have to understand that mindset is everything. Mindset is how we see the world, how we face our problems, how we talk to people. And if you really think about it, right, two people can see the same situation differently. It's about their mindset and how they're seeing the problem that dictates that problem. And you know, the saddest thing about us self-taught developers is that most of us end up quitting because of our mindsets. We believe that, oh, because I wasn't able to solve this bug means that I can't be a coder. I'm telling you, if you aren't where you want to be right now in terms of coding, it's likely because of your mindset. And at its core, if you have a good mindset as you are approaching problems, aka your coding problems or bugs, you can solve anything you want in life. Imagine a world where you're not afraid to face your bugs or you believe in yourself or that you know that you're going to solve this bug or you know you're going to make this app because you actually believe in yourself. So there are two types of mindsets. So the first mindset is the fixed mindset. This is the mindset that most programmers have and is the reason why a lot of programmers fail to code. It is the belief that they can't achieve something, that they're unable to do something because they currently suck at it. And think about it, right? A lot of people quit because they're struggling with JavaScript or struggling with Python and they think that they can't improve at it. They think that because they're struggling or they believe that because they're unable to do something that they cannot do it anymore. And for me, this was a mindset that I had all the time in life. In my mind, I was like, oh my God, I can't learn asynchronous functions. I'm never gonna be a good coder. And that held me back from speeding up and getting better quicker. So look in your life, maybe there's an aspect of your life or in code where you have this sort of fixed mindset where you believe that you can't improve or that you un are unable to solve the problems that you're setting out to do. Because if you do, you're losing right from the start. And I hope I'm showing you how dangerous this sort of mindset is. Now the next mindset, and it's the better mindset, is the growth mindset. This is the belief that you can achieve whatever you set out to do. And not in a cocky way, by growth mindset, I mean acknowledging that you will put in a lot of effort and it will be hard you know that if you try hard enough, you can achieve the things that you set out to do. And rather than getting mad that you're running into issues or running into bugs, you look at them with gratitude and excitement because you know it's going to make you better. It's impossible to lose if you are enjoying the process of sucking and, and running into bugs. And I swear to God, this happened an hour before recording this video. I was coding on this new database called Superbase and I was struggling like crazy. And though in the back of my mind, I wanted to quit. I wanted to just you know, not code this tech platform that I'm working on. I said to myself, I'm going to solve this. And though I wasn't able to solve it with Superbase, I pivoted and I switched up my database and I tried something new and that's working for me. And rather than getting mad at myself that I had to switch databases and that, you know, I wasn't able to do something that I set out to do, I made the right move, I made the right decision and I switched into a different database that provides the same thing and will benefit me just as much. So again, fixed mindset is the belief where you don't believe you can achieve something and that whatever is, is and that you can't learn and improve. Growth mindset is the belief that you can improve and that you can do better and that you can solve whatever you set out to do. If you like this video, Video, check out this video right here.